James Schramko here with John Lint from 10xpro.io. Hey, John. Hello, hello, everybody. Hi. So, John, we've been talking about different ways to do websites and products and memberships. And what I wanted to ask you today is what sort of book funnels have you seen perform well for book authors? And I'm interested in this mm -hmm. because I have a book. And right. I've had mm -hmm. a different funnel than some people. For example, I'm mostly selling my book on Amazon. They take care of the marketing, people read the book, and then they come to my website. And on my website are extra resources, and this will often increase the conversions. But I know there's other ways to do it. Some of my friends give away their book as an ebook and collect leads, and I think that's probably a good thing for me to try next. And I want to see what sort of funnels have you been exposed to, because your tool, 10X Pro, is used by a lot of people who have books, and it was originally designed to set up funnels quickly. So why don't mm -hmm. you share with us yeah. best practice? Yeah, absolutely. There's multiple ways that you can use a book as part of your business, right? So what you're doing, you're basically selling the book and direct sales, people pay. And then there's a back-end strategy there where, you know, they can either find out more about you, they can join your list, and then you can tell them about all your products and services. Another way is what you kind of mentioned, like some people actually... They don't even sell a real book. It's kind of like, okay, I'm going to get you a book, but you're actually buying the digital version of the book uh, that can be $3, $5 online. And then it's pretty much like, you know, a sales page promoting the book. You buy, you're going to get the digital copy straight away. Maybe you might get it in the mail later, but usually in, as part of that strategy, not. Uh, and then the purpose of doing this is that it's the start of a funnel, meaning that it's a low ticket item. Now they join your list, of course. You got a buyer, which is very valuable. And then you might want to have some upsell pages. So in this case, you have the sales page for the book. Next page will be an upsell page where you tell them about something else that you have. That can be your membership. That can be a course, whatever it is. And then from there, you can have either another upsell if you want to, and then a thank you page. So very simple type of funnel um, where you're just collecting leads and buyers up front. Another strategy would be, just before Just you do the next up. strategy, yeah. are these hard to create? Because I'm curious, like extra pages and funnels. No, now if you're using a tool, of course, like 10X Pro, which is built for that, um, everything is in one click. You know, you can install the entire campaign that right, just So it's said, already pre-done and you just fill in. It's already pre-done. Put the picture of the yeah, book, already... put the, the payment details and uh, right. away right. you go. Exactly. So you click a button and the entire campaign will be set up and that's it. And you just customize the content, right? Um, that would be what I would recommend people do, of course. But if you're using your own tool, then it's just basically the pages I said, you know, sell page and then upsell pages and thank you page. Another strategy is the traditional free plus shipping, right? You've seen those a lot. In this case, yeah, they're selling a real book. The attraction is, hey, you're just going to pay for shipping. So you're not going to buy a real book, like, you know, usually a book is $19, $20 or whatever. So in this case, hey, just pay for shipping, which is $5. Again, same strategy as the other one. Get people in, get leads, get buyers, which is very powerful because they're proven buyers. Uh, and then you just escalate. You can have upsell pages, you know, one or two, and then a thank you page. And uh, the goal is to, you're not going to become a millionaire by selling your book, is to get people into the door and then tell them more about your stuff build value, uh, provide value, help them out, show them that you can help them by actually helping them first, and then you know make an offer and tell them about your other stuff. Great. So in summary, a book funnel is one of the highest authority building ways to get people onto your email list. And it positions you well as an expert or an author. And with a few simple installations, you can have your book funnel up and running quickly and start collecting leads and start marketing via email and uh, then your podcasts and newsletters and so forth.